Creating an Apple ID is like getting the keys to the vast Apple ecosystem, from iTunes to iCloud. And it's your ticket to a seamless experience across all Apple devices. Whether you're setting up a new device or just want to access Apple services, having an Apple ID is your first step. Let's walk through the process, making it as easy as pie. Step 1. Choose your method. You can create an Apple ID using any device with a web browser or directly on your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch. It's like deciding whether to walk through the front door or the side gate. If you're using an iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch, open the Settings app, it's the one that looks like yours turning. Tap Sign into your device, you'll find this at the top. Tap Don't have an Apple ID or forgot it. Then tap Create Apple ID. It's like telling the device, hey, let's start our journey together. If you're using a web browser, go to the Apple ID account page, Apple ID. Apple.com It's like walking into the Apple ID office. Click Create Your Apple ID. This is your take a number moment. Step to fill out the form. Whether you're on a device or using a web browser, you'll be asked to provide some details. Think of it as filling out a little get-to-know-you card. Birthday, this helps verify your age. Name, put in your first and last name. Be yourself, country or region, tell them where you're hanging your hat. Email address, this will be your new Apple ID. Use an email address you regularly check. Password, choose a strong one. Mix it up with letters, numbers, and symbols. Security questions, pick questions and answers that you will remember. It's like creating a secret handshake. Step 3. Verify your email address. Apple will send a verification email to the address you provided. It's like they're saying, is this really you? Open the email and click the verification link inside. If you're setting up the ID on an iPhone or iPad, you might receive a verification code instead. Step 4. Agree to the terms and conditions. Read through the terms and conditions or at least skim them. It's like checking the map before a road trip. Then, agree to them. This is your yes, let's hit the road moment. Step 5. Confirmation. Once everything is verified and agreed upon, your Apple ID is ready to go. It's like getting your passport stamped for Apple land. Step 6. Use your Apple ID. Start exploring. Your Apple ID is your personal key to apps, music, cloud storage, and more. It's like having a magic wand for all things Apple. A few tips. Email address. Use an email address you plan to keep. Changing your Apple ID email address later is possible, but it's a bit of a hassle. Password security. Your Apple ID is a gateway to personal information and purchases. Make that password strong and unique. To factor authentication, consider setting this up for an extra layer of security. It's like having a guard dog for your account. And there you have it, you're now the proud owner of an Apple ID. Ready to dive into the ecosystem, that app.